Welcome to another disease-free episode of Clay Can. Today's gonna be a good day. We're gonna stay clean. We're gonna we're gonna be careful. We're gonna do only essential stuff. Today's ham and cheese from Daily Press, $5.99, which is a little expensive for a hamburger, but it's all good. I mean, not a hamburger, but <laughs> really, y'all, I'm being ultra careful with whenever I go into a store or something, I, I spray everything. I keep my keep my lights all close by and really really serious about that stuff you know cleanliness and just watching where I grab and watching what I touch I'm tired of talking about it I'm, I'm not gonna talk about it anymore for the rest of this episode check out my Reese's cup cooling off if there was ever any kind of weakness I had it's right here you can bet that we're working responsibly Son of a bitch, landfill good god it's steam yep. gotta love the landfill but I tell you what beautiful mountain views man right here in Washington Parish Wow! Hey, and if you get stand up in the back of your truck, it doesn't stink as bad. I can't say I've ever seen Conland Mall that that slow. Having to make an essential run to Home Depot, getting only essential items. Just to tell you the truth, it doesn't really seem like the people here are shopping for essential items. I see people buying plants. See, maybe essentials are defined differently between people. I don't know. I can only do me. Rat in the Home Depot parking lot. No vid or COVID, the Home Depot people are still nice. I appreciate that. Good job, Home Depot. That's some wicked zoom. Hi, Dad, thank you. You the man, you the man. Not that this really matters to you, but I had to change out the starter solenoid on my dump trailer earlier. Got that done, all good. There's a wasp. That's the one thing about spring. I always like to show y'all really cool products when I can come across them. Okay, this is like a little solar panel, and it comes combined with a battery tender, and it got a little plug right here. And plug it into your battery, and it tends your battery. And it won't really charge your battery, but it'll keep it like fresh. And if I have this dump trailer parked on a job somewhere, and it's sitting there for maybe three weeks, and this little solar panel's charged up, it does really good with dumping and pretty much don't ever have to charge it but if i'm dumping like 10 loads a day i have to put it on a pretty significant charge cool product batterytender.com it's my buddy ryan yeager right there it's a good man all right so pretty much done with all my essential contracting duties so sometimes i wish i had a taller tripod so now i'm gonna move these bikes around and then i got me a new thing over here all the neighbors had these they were pressure washing their driveway the other day and i, I was kind of envious of them. I was like, wow, that's a cool little tool. You put it on the end of your pressure washer and you could wash your driveway really easily. Pressure washing my own driveway is not really something I do. It's not like, but you know, I'm trying to make the best of this quarantine. I'm trying to actually act like I am quarantined. <laughs> Honestly, not real sure how dirty my driveway actually is, but I got a little bit of mildew right there. And tire marks, I doubt it's gonna take the tire marks off. Maybe that's bird poo, I don't know. Got a little swivel head there, I think it's gonna work good. So far, I'm seeing it's working pretty good. This is the side I've cleaned. This is the side I have not cleaned. After extensive research and a strenuous field trial, I have figured out that this tool is an absolute piece of genius. It seems to be really solid. Longevity, I don't really know about, but pressure washer has lasted a pretty good while. It seems to be pretty solid. And this, this thing here, it'll withstand a fall. Yep, all in all, good tool. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the, uh, hit, 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 hit all the buttons. Hit all the buttons. A few moments later. We're in the middle of quarantine, and we have to do a little bit of barter in here with the neighbors. I need TP, he needs a brewski, but I can't go over there. We're in solitary confinement. This should work good. I this is about to be good. Holy crap. Wish me luck. It's gonna 
Chuck, it was a good trade. That worked out whoa, a lot better than I thought. Y'all don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, turn on the bell, and...